today i am going to talk about structure activity relationship of h2 antagonists i will also discuss the structure activity relationship of proton pump inhibitors so first of all h2 antagonists are the drugs which acts on h2 receptor h2 receptor is a g protein coupled receptor and it is the second type of histamine receptor at the h2 receptor imidazole structure is believed to be important for receptor action this is the structure of imidazole imidazole is a five membered heterocyclic compound containing two nitrogens The imidazole structure exists in two forms. Here you can see the two forms of imidazole. These forms are tautomeric in nature. So we can say these are two tautomers of imidazole. Now in case of two tautomeric forms, the form first seems to be necessary for maximal H2 antagonist activity. where the r is substituted with ch3 the activity becomes potent this is the structure of cimetidine which contains ch3 at r group and cimetidine is an potent compound other features include chain of four carbon atom which is optimal for the activity shorter chain drastically lowers the activity here you can see in cimetidine there is a chain length of four carbon atoms this chain is in between this heterocyclic ring system and the terminal nitrogen the presence of thioether in the methylene place lead to more activity the presence of terminal n group increase the activity this is the terminal n group now we will discuss structure activity relationship of cimetidine in this picture you can see the structure of cimetidine now for any compound to be h2 antagonist it should contain an aromatic ring system with n electrons next to the side chain the presence of the heterocyclic imidazole ring is not required in cimetidine there is an aromatic heterocyclic ring system but in case of ranitidine there is furon ring system it means that heterocyclic imidazole ring system is not a necessity but if the imidazole ring system is present only one tautomer should predominate the tautomer is promoted by electron donors at position 5 this is the position 5 and this is the ch3 group which is a electron donor group an electron withdraws at position 4 this is the position 4 the terminal nitrogen group should be polar but not basic for maximal potency this is the terminal nitrogen group
now in case of h2 antagonist this terminal nitrogen should be polar and it should have acidic characters now separation of the ring from the nitrogen group by four atoms gives maximal potency now see this this is the ring system and this is the terminal nitrogen in between there are four atoms 1 2 3 and 4 so separation of the ring from the nitrogen by four atoms gives this compound maximal potency now note here that the electron donor methyl at c5 an electron withdrawing side chain at c4 and also a basic cyanogonadine terminal nitrogen group this one is cyanogonadine terminal nitrogen group gives this compound maximal potency now i am going to discuss the structure activity relationship of proton pump inhibitors this is the structure of omeprazole which is a proton pump inhibitor now structure of omeprazole consists of three parts substituted benzimidazole ring this one is the benzimidazole ring which is substituted substituted pyridine ring this one is the substituted pyridine ring and CS2 SO chain this portion represents CH2 SO chain system now increase in the percent of cationic pyridine also increases the nucleophilic character of proton pump inhibitors cationic pyridine facilitates the intermolecular nucleophilic attack at c2 of benzimidazole ring leading to the formation of active sulfenamide and sulfenic acid metabolites this is the pyridine portion of the ring this one is the benzimidazole portion of the ring this pyridine portion of the ring becomes cationic because of this methoxy group methoxy group donates electrons to this nitrogen and that's how it becomes cationic now cationic pyridine facilitates the intermolecular nucleophilic attack at c2 position of benzimidazole ring this leads to formation of active metabolites of omeprazole these active metabolites are sulfenamide and sulfenic acid these two metabolites inhibits the proton pump presence of methyl group at c3 and 5 positions enhances nucleophilic attack of unionized pyridine nitrogen these are two methyl groups they helps in the enhancement of nucleophilic character of unionized pyridine nitrogen Thank you.